Top 5 Best Bass Ukulele Number 5. Oscar Schmidt OUB 200K As the manager of a small acoustic music store, I've come across a number of Oscar Schmidt instruments over the years, including guitars, mandolins, and standard ukuleles. To be honest, I was never all that impressed with their instruments. They were usually okay, but never great. Based on customer feedback, the OUB 200K is decent, but probably not the best value. It does have some interesting design features, like the partial cutaway and beveled armrest. I'm not sure how important these features are on a bass ukulele, but they certainly set it apart from the pack. Coming in number 4. Donner DUB1 Electric Ukulele Bass I was very impressed with the Donner DUC1 Concert Ukulele I reviewed. I felt it was a good ukulele for the money, especially when compared with models that cost nearly twice as much. The Donner DUB1 is considerably cheaper than the Kala U bass, but still seems to be a good quality instrument. This might be the best option for people who want to play around with a ukulele bass but don't want to make a big investment. The majority of customer reviews praised the instrument's tone, playability, and overall quality. There were a few valid complaints among the negative reviews, such as issues with the pickup and tuner not working. But I also saw a lot of people who just had unrealistic expectations or didn't understand the quirks of bass ukuleles in general. Coming in number 3. Kala Rumbler U-Bass. The Rumbler is essentially an upgraded version of the Wanderer. It has the same laminated mahogany body as the Wanderer, but it has a few features usually only found on Kala's higher-end models, TUS, Q-Nut, and Composite Saddle. Custom Shadow NFX Electronics with built-in tuner. Bound Body. Deluxe Gig Bag. Coming in number 2. Kala Exotic Mahogany U-Bass. The defining feature of this Kala ukulele bass is the exotic mahogany body. This wood is a type of figured mahogany with a gold stain that mimics the look of koa or flame maple. According to Kala's website, the exotic mahogany U-Bass is their best-selling bass uke. I've seen these before in person and can see why. They're beautiful instruments and the wood they use is usually really nice looking. This U-Bass has most of the upgraded components found on Kala's higher-end instruments. The laminated wood body helps keep the cost down, but it may not sound quite as warm as the models with solid wood. Coming in number 1. Kala Wanderer U-Bass. The Wanderer is Kala's simplest and most affordable U-Bass model. It has a laminated mahogany body and minimal cosmetic features help keep the price down. In terms of build quality, the Ubus WNDRFS is just as good as Kala's fancier, more expensive U-Bass models. It's a good option for players who want a good quality ukulele bass but don't want to spend too much money. Laminated Wood Body The Wanderer has a laminated body, which is one way Kala can offer this uke bass at such a low price. The all-laminated body probably won't sound quite as warm and rich as the models I cover below that have solid wood. However, I've played a ton of great-sounding laminated instruments over the years, so don't let this single factor scare you away.